Alright guys, we're back with another video, and I'm going to tell you how to walk any top water bait. This thing is going to have uh, two, two like kind of segments to it or whatever. I'm going to tell you guys how I learned to walk any top water bait, and I'm going to tell you guys how you can uh, do the same thing. So, the key here is with walking any type of bait, no matter what's a frog or spook or popper, is you gotta have slack on in the line. You can't walk a bait unless you have slack in the line. And what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna you're gonna purposely leave a little bit of slack, and then you're gonna like pop that slack, and you're you're gonna you're and and that what that bait's gonna do with the spook. The difference between a frog and a spook is. You're moving your rod tip more with the spook, obviously, because it's like a, a way lo a, a bigger and longer bait. You're basically going to want to move your rod tip a little bit more than you would a frog. And that bait's going to zigzag through. you be able to cover a lot of water with that. Um, so, uh, you're basically uh, going to, yeah, like, you're going to leave slack on line. You're basically going to twitch slack. It doesn't really matter if you're with a... Um, uh, a frog, a popper, or a spook. How I uh, learned to walk any bait, any topwater bait, is I basically, um, fro I used to frog fish a lot. Like, that's all I would do. And I would spend so much time with them, and yet I couldn't really walk them. But then I, I kind of learned how to walk them by uh, popping slack. And ever since then, ever since I learned how to walk frogs, I literally um, took a spook out like one time. I haven't even thrown a spook before this. I left slack in line before, before I knew that this thing was zigging, uh, zigzagging across the water. So ba basically how I learned is I basically uh, walked a frog and then I could walk anything else. Um... It doesn't really matter if your rod tip's up or low. As long as you're twitching your uh, a little bit of slack in your line, you should be able to walk any of these three baits. So thank thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.